All right. Sweat, five, six. All right. Shannon Brock. Ed totally dominated this. <laughs> First trad lead in a while. He's got about 18 pieces of pro in there. One, uh, one every half foot. Oh, did it? Lifted all in. I didn't think those nuts would hold anything. Nuts. What are they good for? Yeah, just jam. What? Half the loads are engaged, the other half are just sitting there whacking it, doing nothing. Very poor fan placement. Basically, that would rip right out. We'll edit that out later. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hey, it's big. So, so far, was there anything that would have held? <laughs> I think some of those nut placements might have held. Like, what, what, would, what could you have done differently? Seated them better, si appropriately sized them, worked a little bit harder to get the cams in the right spot. Uh, okay. You think that was just Definitely a better placement all around? Yeah. <laughs> this one, this this cam's good. This number, this number uh, one right here is good. I'll, I'll give myself props for that. All right. This cam's good too. This number two. Okay. Well, yeah. So you would have been fine. The camera locks tend to, to be nice because they've got the dual axles. Yeah. They, uh, so they have a lot more camming, and they tend to be more forgiving. Yeah. Placement wise. This number three is pretty solid too. Oh, see, you were fine. Yeah, but all the right, all the upper stuff. Is yeah, I guess you would have ducked down if you were falling up there. The, yeah. This is the second, so the only other piece was one you took out, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, but that one you moved up for a while, so. Yep, which worked out. Yeah. Don't ever question me on that again. It's out of curiosity, learning, man. As you can see, I was no, in no state of mind. So. <laughs> to teach. Now, you know what? Maybe we can get my cam. Yeah, let's try. Yeah, I mean, don't try right now. We can do it on top rope. Or if you want to. I just want to look and see if I can figure out where, the, where it went. Okay, you'll have to... Up here where the arch comes over. Yeah. There's a little ledge deep in the crack. It might have fallen into that. Or it might have... I thought I dropped it earlier and I thought it could skedaddle down there. Yeah. By the way, this is about four hours after our first climb. It took us about uh, four hours to recuperate from <laughs> the uh, 120 degree temperatures out here. Uh, and having to climb that, you know, 510 plus, or 510A, whatever. Don't forget about the 8 climb. That's yeah. right, yeah. Don't forget about the big wall. Yeah. All right. All right. No sweat. No sweat. <laughs>